Now this is an output of DES function. Now this becomes this becomes an input for an XOR with L1 and then the output is the one which we are looking for. Now this right R1 is directly based to the L1 of the next round. So now we need to identify what is this L1 is XORed with the output of this function. So this is the output of the function, this bits and it is XORed with L1. So let's look how we do an XOR. The output of the function is what we have calculated and L0 is represented in bits and it is XORed with to form an output. So it is 0, 0 is 0, 1, 0 is 1, 0, 0 is 0, 0, 1 is 1. Whenever it is 1, 1, it becomes 0, 0, 0, it becomes 0, and 1, 0 is 1, 0, 1 is 1. So we get an output of the first round. So that is 5A78E394. So that is what we have calculated here. So now same thing, this is the output wave of the first round. Now again this right is right and left both acts as an input for the next round R2. And we calculate the key here and again the key is XORed with the R0 and then we play uh, uh, R0 and L0 and then we give an input to the next round. So that is how we calculated the ciphertext.